everything you see around you, like the device that you're using to watch this video, was made by somebody with a bright idea. Do you have an idea that's been lingering in your mind that you really want to start but you don't know what next step to take? The WP Carey School of Business and the Fulton Schools of Engineering have created Entrepreneurship and Value Creation, a course for students just like you who have an entrepreneurial idea but don't have either a team or the right resources to get off the ground. If you want to start a business while you're at ASU, start by taking Management 360 FSE 301. Okay, so what is this class all about? Basically, it has five very specific steps that we're going to try to follow as a group. Uh, they look pretty easy on, at face value, but actually they're really hard. Uh, entrepreneurship is probably the hardest thing that you and your teammates will ever uh, embark upon as a group or individually. So if you're ready to go, let's buckle up and go through them. So first, what we're going to do is identify a very pressing problem that you yourself have, or your family has, or your community has, whatever it is, something that's very painful uh, out in the world or an opportunity that you see could be improved upon. Second, because this class is cross-listed between engineering and business, we get those two disciplines together, uh, these disparate backgrounds come together and are able to uh, uh, kind of combine super ninja skills and, and really hypothesize and spitball some really good ideas about how to address that painful problem. And then third, you know, it's all about hypothesis. So you're going to identify a whole series of solutions that your team could potentially implement within the marketplace in a very short amount of time. And then the next step there is to actually take those guesses about how that solution might actually evolve and map them onto what's called a business model canvas. So we generate a series of guesses leveraging this tool, which keeps everything organized. And then finally, you take those guesses out into the real world and you actually interact with human beings to either validate or reject which of your guesses or hypotheses were actually right or wrong. And actually, nine times out of ten, your guesses that you make with your team about the problem and the solution are completely bogus right out of the gate. So that's where the rigor comes in. This is going to be a lot of hard work cycling through these steps to make sure you're actually developing a solution to a problem that actually exists and you're building something that people actually want at the end of the day. Uh, so it's all about iteration. It's all about hustle. It's all about uh, putting your head down and putting your ego aside. And if you're willing to do that, then you have an opportunity to gain additional support through a variety of uh, fundraising opportunities. Uh, most uh, accessible are the, the competitions that exist across, across ASU. So let's check those out. Speaking of funding, ASU presents you with multiple opportunities for grant funding. For example, Helos received $20,000 from the Igniter Challenge. By the end of this class, you can be positioned well enough to compete very highly in these competitions. So good luck, and we'll see you in class.